So now that we have the Titan Accelerator on the live server, I'm kind of wondering, you know, how fast does the Nodens go? Okay, the reason why I chose the Nodens is because uh, we take a look at the uh, speed here, 50 kilometers an hour uh, when maxed out, and uh, we compare it to, you know, maxed out Titans, uh, the Kid, the Arth, and the Ao Ming. You can see the speed relative to, uh, you know, these Titans. So it's actually faster than all of them, but now with this uh, module, uh, when it's maxed out, you get another 10 kilometers an hour. So this thing is going to be flying. Um, I'm kind of curious to see how fast this is going to go. I've actually tried it on the Kid Titan, and that was fast. Um, but I think <laughs> this thing is going to be a whole nother story. So we have an uh, antimatter reactor. We have two-plated armor. You know, I'm kind of wondering, is it worth using the accelerator on here or the self-fix? I think that's, uh, you know, one thing I'm going to be looking out for. And I will play a game and then some action clips of... Uh, you know, the uh, Nodens, maybe with different builds for the action clips. Uh, but that's what we're going to do. Uh, in terms of the rest of my hangar, we have a Strider, we have the Behemoth, uh, the Raven with uh, Triple Jump, as you can see here. Uh, we have the Scorpion. I did a video on this yesterday, so if you happen to miss it, I'll put a card uh, in the top right corner of the screen. And there should be a link in the video description as well. We also have the uh, Blitz with uh, this funky looking uh, quarker. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. I guess that's the uh, the vent one. Okay. And uh, yep. So that's going to be my hanger. So I'm going to run one game with this Nodens and uh, you know with the Titan Accelerator on it. And some action clips uh, maybe with the Cyclone and possibly the Rupture. Just to see how it uh, performs. So uh, yeah. Let's hop into game number one. Okay, so we've just dropped in on uh, Moon Map, and I've uh, started with the uh, Raven first here. I see a couple of players uh, moving in on this uh, side here. i try to keep them back. Um, oh, jeez, they got a uh, Ares or something back there. You gotta watch out for that guy. And someone else has, like, is that Vortex? No, Thermite, I can hear it. Which one is it? I think it's this guy here. You know what? Let's try to do this. Oh, shoot. That guy got hit bad. <laughs> oh, man. Come on. No. Oh, she's This guy <laughs> right behind this, too. I'm going to get killed here. Nope. We're still alive. We're still alive. Uh, uh, hold that thought, hold that thought. <laughs> trying to get this Ares. Oh, jeez. I'm trying to get out of here. Maybe get this guy. He's down to his uh, last stand. I'm going to jump to get more health here. Yep, there we go. Okay, let me just uh, wait until I have a jump. Oh, this guy. Another... Wait. Is that a... That's another Cerberus. They had a Cerberus earlier. Is this guy running like multiple Cerberus? Is it the same guy? I don't know if it's the same guy. This Raven's killing it. <laughs> that guy's out. Got a lot of lag going on here. Okay, so we have four beacons here. This is good. Except, take a look at what's going on there. My Nodens is now ready. So let's drop in with the uh, Nodens. Oh, I can heal this guy up. A lot of stuff happening over there. Let's get this guy. That guy there too. Um, who else needs healing here? Where is my team? Okay, that guy's gone into flight. I tried to heal up my uh, teammate here in the center, but there's a guy up in the uh, top there. <laughs> and the thing is... When you have players like that overlapping or behind each other, it's actually harder for me to heal players. 
So this guy here is going to be easier to heal. So there we go. I'm going to suppress this player here because he's doing too much damage to my uh, teammate. Take a look at the speed of this thing too. Trying to heal this other guy here, but you see what I mean? Like, I have to wait. Yep. <laughs> By the time I, I was able to get to him, I was uh, killed. Trying to get that guy back there. Just suppress them. Yeah, this, uh, this Nodens moves pretty fast. Uh, let's see if I can heal this guy up. Just suppress these guys. So you see what I'm doing is, I'm trying to lock on another player there so I can hit this uh, Nightingale. So we're going to get him down to his last stand first. Suppress that guy. There's a Nightingale there I'm trying to get. There we go. <laughs> I'm trying to move this way. This guy's going to get me here. There we go. Let's just heal this guy up. There we go. I'm gonna move this way. I'm gonna heal that player up there. And this one here. Just waiting for my um, my weapons here. I'm gonna suppress this guy. We have a player moving to the right side as well. Just trying to take this guy out first. Heal up that player. This guy's healing me. It's now three versus six or five. Uh oh. We gotta heal this guy up. What is that? Oh, jeez. Are these guys up top in the center here or what? Oh, they have a Nodens here. Things are going to get crazy, guys. Yeah, there's a lot of guys here. There's a Nodens here, too. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go straight for this guy. It's a really risky move, I know. But I do want to take this guy out here. You can see how fast this Nodens goes, it's pretty crazy. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Two Nodens. But you know what, I took out their Ming, so they can't sit back now and camp, but... At least you guys get a idea of how fast that thing is, it's pretty quick actually. Um, let's drop in with the uh, Scorpion. I'm going to get this guy here with death mark. He's wondering what's going on. Yeah, that hurt. That really hurt. We might be able to kill him with the corrosion. I've got to move back here. Oh shoot, there's a guy right behind me. Oh man. This is where the scorpion's going to die, unfortunately. Um, I can drop in here with the behemoth. Oh shoot, this guy did not see me. Titan Slayer. Trying to get this guy up top here, frozen. Oh jeez, I need to get... Wait a minute, it's only me left. Uh oh. Five cap. I take this guy out. Just waiting for him to. There we go. And this guy. Man, how many bots do these guys have? <laughs> three versus five. There's still three versus five. How many guys have I killed? 
Okay, um, I'm gonna have to kill the bot here. I'm trying to think, um, maybe the uh, the strider, so I can jump over and uh, get a beacon here. Let's try to go for this beacon. Okay, so I'm gonna get this beacon here. No, 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 no! Stay there, stay there, dude, stay there. Okay, I might be able to uh, get this. Someone else is helping me here. That's perfect. Holy crap, this is an intense game. If he gets that beacon... I got the blitz still. Yes! Yes! Ah, hurry! Hurry! <laughs> 50 seconds. Man, this game is intense. Let's take that guy out. We're changing this beacon. Holy crap, this has got to be like the, the closest game ever. Trying to get this uh, Loki. There we go, got him. Can we get this beacon? I don't know if we're going to have enough time. He has more bots. What the heck? Oh, shoot. I got to get to the side. Oh, come on. <laughs> that was the craziest game ever. Man, how many guys did I kill? I just kept killing them one after the other. And it's like we were down two players or something. Holy crap, look at my score. 6.5 million, 18 kills, 5 beacons. And we were down a player. No wonder, man. Jeez. <laughs> I kept killing them and they kept spawning in. I'm like, when is the last guy going to show up? So that was 5 versus 6. But you know what? Very well played to my team because for us to survive that long, it's because we went for beacons and we held it down. And you can see everyone did... Uh, you know, their job here, so very well played to my uh, teammates. Let's take a look actually at their hangers. Okay, so this play over here, let's take a look at what he's running. Yeah, that, that, was, a pretty, <laughs> that was a pretty epic game. That was crazy. I was running from one beacon to the next. You know what? I'm kind of glad that I had my, um, my strider with the jump because I think that kind of helped uh, at the end there. So uh, this is what this player is running. I'm just going to go through, uh, you know, my teammates here because they did uh, such a good job at, you know, holding down beacons, pushing it. Um, it's unfortunate we lost that game because they were really trying their hearts out there. So uh, let's take a look at, uh, I think it's uh, this guy here. Last one, even this player here contributed a lot. So very well played to uh, this player. I know you're in Master League, but you know what? You did a really good job at... Uh, you know, holding beacons, you can see. I know he has one beacon there, but he uh, played a role as well because I don't think the game would have been as close uh, if it wasn't for my teammates. Uh, let's take a look at this uh, duo squad here. So this guy is running quite a bit of uh, MK2. Uh, not maxed. Uh, his weapons are somewhat maxed. Let's take a look at his uh, Ao Ming. Okay. And uh, this guy here, yep, same clan. And uh, let's take a look at, um, I guess, this player here. And uh, he had the Nodens. So I think there was one thing I could have done differently. And again, this is all hindsight. Um, you know, I didn't know we were down a player. But uh, to play my Nodens a little bit more carefully, <laughs> um, I went straight for that Ao Ming there towards, uh, not towards the end, but, you know, I knew that they had an Ao Ming out, and I tried to take him out so that they didn't have that range. Um, so I sacrificed my uh, Nodens, but, you know, that's uh, pretty much it in terms of uh, the honor points here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump into some action clips now. Maybe with the uh, Nodens, with, uh, you know, the Cyclone and also the uh, Rupture to see how that does. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of the speed of the Nodens with this thing. Do you guys want to see me actually run the Accelerator on the Arthur? Because I know you guys were asking me about that. So I decided to kind of flip things here, you know, put it on the fastest uh, Titan to see how fast it can move around the map. And, uh, you know, that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did... Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later. I think 
you're really going to start to see um, you know the advantages of having that speed when you need to cover areas uh, very quickly here Trying to link to as many players as possible. Um, gotta watch out for this guy here. One thing I have to be careful of is linking too many times. Because, uh, you know, if there's an emergency, for example, like I need um, to heal myself, I won't have any uh, heals left. Okay, so there's a player over here. Actually, we have to be careful. There's two titans on that, that side there. Uh, what is this guy in? Yeah, I have to watch out here. I'm gonna suppress that guy. I'm gonna back up. Let's just heal that player. Heal this guy as well. This guy can make a push here. <laughs> Jeez, we even losing sound. Can you hear that? Come on. I'm gonna back up here. Here we go. Gotta be careful. There's a lot of stuff happening here. <laughs> oh, jeez. What was that? Gotta help out with this guy here too. Oh man, he's gonna get that beacon. Trying to link to my teammate over there as well. There we go. This one here. I need to uh, reload quick. This guy's gonna need my help. This Arthur as well. Gonna suppress him, heal up my teammate. Okay, so we got that guy. Oh, that's a behemoth. I was wondering what that was. Oh jeez, that's gonna, that's gonna hit pretty bad. You know what's really nice about this speed is you can get to your teammates quickly. Um, just heal him up. And this guy here too. Oh, trying to heal. Oh, shoot. Trying to make my way over to this side here because we need uh, my teammates need to get on that beacon. Here we go. I'm gonna try to hit this player, but the problem is I don't have um, 600 meter range weapons. So I guess this is one way to avoid um, getting hit by like 600 meter range weapons. At least you have speed. Which allows you to retreat quicker. Let's try to heal up my teammate there. Uh, we have this guy here I'm going to try to hit. Trying to heal up my uh, teammate again. And that one too if I can. Uh, hold on a second. Hold on buddy. Holy jeez that's close. Trying to get this guy here. Suppress that guy. Heal up if I can. 
Trying to heal him. There we go. Trying to preserve his... Oh, shoot. <laughs> I tried to get that guy too. I think he's going to drop once he gets hit. Yep. Maybe. So you see how that guy's hitting me. And I'm able to retreat quick here. Because of the uh, accelerator module. Let's get this guy. That should get him, right? There we go. We have to get the uh, left side there, though. We're losing all our beacons. And the thing is, with this particular build I'm using right now, this is not a build you want to use to... Like, go straight for beacons because of the reload time. I'm going to see if I can help him with this guy here. I am hitting him. So we're going to use suppression. Let's take that guy out. Going to heal up that guy there. Let's go for this one here. That should do it. No? There we go. 